Telangana State Engineering, Agriculture and Medical Common Entrance Test. Sounds big, right? But simply put, it's a state level entrance exam for students in Telangana who wants to get into professional courses like BE, BTEC, B Pharma, Pharma D, BSc, BFSc, and even BVSc. This exam happens once a year and is the key gateway to both universities and private colleges in Telangana. Now the admission process is pretty structured. Once the exam is done, your marks and rank in TS decide where you will land. And seat allotment happens through an online centralized counseling system. Here's an important point. To even get into the rank list, you need to score at least 25% of the maximum marks in the exam. But if you belong to STSC category, the good news is there is no minimum qualifying marks required for you. Is that one test that opens doors to wide range of professional courses in Telangana. Now let's quickly go over the exam pattern. The exam will be held in online mode, that's CBT or computer based test. You will get a total of 3 hours to complete the paper. There will be 160 multiple choice questions and here's the good part. Each correct answer gives you plus one mark, but there is no negative marking. So no fear of losing marks for wrong attempts. When it comes to language options, you have got three choices. English only, English plus Telugu, English plus Urdu. And remember, the entire paper will be MCQ based. So it's all about smart practice and time management. For engineering aspirants, the paper has mathematics 80 questions, physics 40 questions and chemistry 40 questions. For those appearing in agriculture and medical stream, it's biology 80 questions, that's 40 from botany and 40 from zoology, physics 40 questions and chemistry 40 questions. Important to understand the eligibility criteria. First is nationality. You must be an Indian national or PIO OCI card holder. Also, you should belong to Telangana or Andhra Pradesh and meet the local or non-local status requirement as per state rules. Next is age limit. You should be at least 17 years old as on December 31st of the admission year. The upper age limit is 22 years for general candidates and 25 years for STSC candidates. The topics and chapters for physics, chemistry and mathematics subjects. The physics syllabus include a mix of basics and advanced topics from both class 11th and 12th. Some key areas are dual nature of radiation, nuclei, semiconductor electronics, communication systems, etc. The chemistry syllabus is divided into physical organic and inorganic chemistry. Their key subjects are displayed on the screen. Maths mainly focuses on calculus, differential and integral calculus, vectors and probability. Topics that really test problem solving speed. The botany syllabus covers diversity of living world, reproduction, systematics, plant physiology, plant ecology, etc. For zoology, you will study animal diversity, human anatomy and physiology all systems, reproduction, genetics, biology and human welfare etc. Now let's discuss some quick tips on how to prepare for this exam. Be thorough with syllabus, plan a proper timetable, start with basics, study on daily basis, practice from the previous year's sample paper, revision is compulsory, avoid adding new topics at the last minute of preparation and include stress busters. It's important to study the correct books for preparation. The best way to start is to be thorough with the class 11th and 12th books. Some common books recommended by the experts for each subject are shown on the screen for physics, chemistry and biology. Candidate needs to fill in the choice of colleges and courses in order of preference, pay the processing fee and book a slot of certificate verification at the helpline center. Now let's talk about seat allotment. Allotment is based on ranking. Selected candidates must pay admission fees and report to the allotted college. Carry original documents for verification and they will be returned after checking. Submit Xerox copies of documents and the original transfer certificate at the college. If you have any confusions, you can simply send hey on the number given on the screen.